Back inside the Mali Sports Center, the European Figure Skating Championships presented by Samsung continue the ladies' free skate with Galina Monyachenko from Ukraine on the ice. The 21-year-old from Kiev who's in fourth place after the short program. This will no doubt be her best finish ever at the European Championships. She came in eighth last year. Her opening jump is triple lutz double toe. She'll reach back. Nice spring. But you know, she took that so close into the corner that you almost thought she was not going to be able to flow out of it. And in fact, it didn't go straight out. It curved sharply. And then she couldn't complete the double toe that she had planned on doing afterwards. And look at this one again, three feet from the boards. She's a former pair skater. She was severely injured during a side-by-side -side spin. Her partner's skate blade sliced her, her face. And she took a year and a half off and came back as a single skater. But she does have strong edges, good speed, and a very nice presence on the ice. There's nothing flailing around about it. I mean, look at how steady that triple Salkow was. But the extension on those flying camels, that could use a lot of improvement. This music practically vibrates in this building. You can feel it. I do feel it. <laughs> the broadcast booth here. Dreadful leg position. Visit the situation here. Slutskaya has beaten Butirskaya in the free skate. If someone else also beats Butirskaya, Slutskaya can win. Uh, win. Well, I don't think it's going to be Galina Maniachenko. No. step up into this a wide skidding edge which kept her from getting much height on it but it was steady now this final combination spin doesn't hold these positions very long and they're not very good either She does have a very steady quality, that's for sure. Well, she was 31st in the world last year at the World Championship, so just to be in this position is an accomplishment, but wasn't the performance Galina Manyachenko was looking for. We'll check her marks in a moment. From Ukraine, when we come back, Sylvia Fontana takes the ice. She recently won her fourth national championship in Italy. She had a great short program here. She's in fifth place right now. She'll skate next. The International Olympic Committee has been headquartered here in Lausanne on the shores of Lake Geneva since 1915. 
As a tribute to all of the Olympic Games through history, the Olympic Museum was opened nine years ago with special exhibitions showing the evolution of the Games. Sonia Henny's skates and Katarina Witt's famous Carmen costume from her 1988 Olympic gold medal performance are some of the artifacts on display. And a vast video library highlights the great athletic moments in Olympic history. Galina Manyachenko with the first set of marks for technical merit, 5.2, the low mark up to 5.6. And I think those are pretty decent. I mean, I think she, she completed five triple jumps in the program. They were okay, but the rest of the program, I felt, was a little sloppy and a little disconnected. Yeah, maybe better than expected, these marks. Presentation marks 5.2 to 5.7. That puts her in third place overall behind Gutierrezskaya and Slutskaya. Thank you. So we move on here at the European Figure Skating Championships presented by Samsung. Maria Butierskaya has the lead, but it is not a solid one right now over Arena Slutskaya and Galina Manyachenko with Sylvia Fontana taking the ice. figure skating there have been some Carmen's in our past watch this opening combination a double instead of a triple Lutz very wide free leg on these jumps it makes the rotations very tough to complete Was elegant. Born in New York, raised in Rome, she had a terrific performance in the short program.